All right, guys, what is up? We are back with the next episode of Pokemon Uranium. I still wanted to save up real quick, just to make sure you know. All right, last episode almost an hour long. I guess it was kind of 700 subscriber special ish, but not really. But uh, it was more of me making up for you know sporadic uploads. But uh, hopefully, gonna be able to push out quite a few of these episodes in a row. Hopefully, um, until the end. And, um, yeah, let's get into it. Last episode, we took on the gym leader, beat him, obtained the power of Mega Evolutions, then fought our rival with our newly found Mega, you know, powers. And, um, yeah. Able to beat him. Um, I thought you said you were gonna meet us, okay. Alright, I flew here on P Pajay. Hope I'm pronouncing it right. As soon as I got the phone call from Thea, well, it helped that I was already in East Tender. And from here, from this point on out, this is all new from our last LP. So I'm gonna, you know, it's gonna be new to me as it is to you guys. I was catching some way up. I mean, doing important field work, of course. That is, um, so it's true. You managed to defeat the gym and gain the power of Mega Evolutions. Yes, and TG and TZG and I battle on top of the mountain. It was awesome, wonderful, goodness. It's been so long. Look how much you two have grown. I remember when you were there in my lab for the first time, taking your trainer test, and you weren't very happy about your results. Still, yeah, don't remind me. But now I'm glad I have Metal Links. We were able to use Mega Evolution together. Indeed, as you know, Mega Evolution was discovered recently in the Kalos region. It involves a reaction between a Mega Stone held by a Pokemon and a Keystone, like the one in a Mega Bracelet. This reaction is made possible by the bonds that you and your Pokemon share. Dude, this music is perfect for this moment. There are several tender Pokemon capable of Mega Evolution, particularly the starter Pokemon that I gave you. In order to evolve them, though, you need to find the Mega Stones. Those are hidden all around Tender, and I can't ex say exactly where you'll find them. It's a treasure hunt. Sweet. Yes, that's exactly right. Now then, you're going to enc be encountering Mega Evolution, Mega Pokemon. I'll need to give you both upgrades to Pokedex. So we got the Mega Pokedex, sort of. I look forward to your findings. Now then, what more can you tell me about your adventure? What, you have visited Laxra Lab and his thugs ambushed you? And oh dear, oh dear. That's insane. I can't believe that guy would go so far. Should have warned you when I knew him. In university, Laxra was always unscrupulous. He go to any links to get rec recognized. Sorry, I can't read right now. And he didn't care about who got hurt in the process. I'm glad to hear you managed to break free and get your Pokemon back. You and Garlic Kid make a good team. I'm glad you found each other. So, Professor, where do we go now? Alright. Well, you're almost finished with the gym challenge. Only one more gym remains, and it's in Angular Town, south of Venice City. Fortunately, that stretch of ocean is besieged by pirates. They, they, eh, they really are. They are really a big problem here in East Tender. Makes traveling seas very difficult. Not to mention that that East Tender nuclear power plant is near Su Tsukunami as well. I'm worried that whatever or whoever it was that caused the meltdowns will strike again. I ain't afraid of no nuclear Pokemon. Yes, I imagine you two can take care of yourselves. I'm just being cautious, that's all. Plus, there are some Pokemon that you will need to complete your Pokedex. There are rare Pokemon found only at the bottom of the sea. In order for you to find them, I have these HMs for you. Alright, so we get that. Why don't we get Fly? That's what I'm trying to find out. Sweet, I, can f I can't wait to find some awesome Pokemon in the ocean floor. Plus, I heard there are legendary Pokemon that live there too. Can't express how proud I am of you two. I know that you will only impress me more as time goes on. I'm tired of standing around. I'm going to go to Tsukunami and get my eighth batch. Forgive me, but I must be off. I'm going. I'm doing research on nuclear Pokemon. The tent. Do you just surfing? All right. Tender Rangers are trying to find a cure. This is an elemental affliction. I think I. Since it's an elemental affliction, I think it can help. Remember, if you counter any nuclear types, catch them for me. I'd love to study them back at the lab. And 
I know you're strong, but do be careful. The last nuclear power plant in Tandor is Tsukunami. I'm worried that whatever caused other plants to melt down could strike again. And look out for Theo, alright? Let's get up out of here. Oh, yeah, we need Fly too. Alright, so we need to head to Venice. I might just cut. Don't want to cut. Yeah, I'll, just, I'll pause it until we get there. I don't want you guys to go through all that. I will see you guys back in Venice City. Alright guys, we're back. We're not in Venice City, but um, I actually ran to this dude who's talking about pirates. And we might be able to hit a ride with him, so let's see what he's going. We're strong trainer on board, I reckon they'll leave us alone. Are you perhaps heading to Venice City? Yeah. Alright, so he's gonna give me a lift there. Not bad. Yeah, I was... I was worried I was gonna have to go all the way back to Venice City. Oh, listen to the music! Oh, the man step! Oh, he a pirate! Okay. Yo, the pirate theme kinda sound a little powerful right now. I'm planning to steal all your Pokemon while we're at sea. But then me pirate catchphrase slipped out. Guess we gotta do this hard way. Give me your Pokemon or you be walking the plank. Yo, okay, I'm, I'm liking the pirate. Okay. Build a car and you got a swab on. Hold on, how do we want to do this? Oh, hit up that mega evolution on you boys. And Nucleon hit with this dude. That thing looks like a Cubone pirate form almost. That might kill. I'm not sure how strong his stats are in mega form. Alright, it didn't kill. Okay. I actually want to put. Who do I want to put in front? Drain life. What? Tanking that. Oh, never mind. I may get a bunch of HP back for that. Almost all of it. All right, you need to calm down. Hagras, yo, I look like a bug Pokemon. I don't know how I want to go about attacking these dudes. All right, let's see how this works. All right, it's definitely not a bug Pokemon. Probably put. Oh, we got a burn. Okay, not bad. All right, I might beat him. Yeah, okay, we get a crit. Who do I want to put in front? Like Daikatuna, maybe? Sludge Wave. Okay. Okay, good. Good attack to Achilles. Oh, he attacks both. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. I think he's definitely poison type. Okay. Yeah, we'll go with Siding. Yeah, we'll go with Siding. Once we get him trained up, then we definitely gotta get fill a card up to speed. Alright. Um, flamethrower. And. Did I flamethrower siding? That's what it looked like. Hold on, go back, make sure. I'm not trying to do anything stupid. No. No one in doubt. Alright, think about like poison. Maybe dragon? No. Might just be pure poison. Maybe dark, I guess. Yarg. Silva's gonna be mad at me for this. Mark my word, landlubber. You haven't seen the last of Pirate Jack. And here's a Bro, you're not gonna take me back to Venice? Oh. Well, you can take me back, big dog. Excuse me, I watched your battle from afar. That guy was a pirate, right? Thought he might be. Normally the black flag pirates don't stray this far north. They're getting more rowdy as of late. Anyways, I wanted to thank you. Do I like this little pirate thing they got going? Show them a lesson. Hopefully you won't come back sniffling around Silverport again. If there's anything I can yeah, you can take me to Venice. Yeah. Okay. My boy coming through. Uh 
Let's see if Pokemon Center real quick. I think it's up here. No, that's the gym. Alright, I wonder how we can battle one of those Griffin Pokemons. Find it, Pokemon Center. I think it is Crosshair. Yeah. It's been a while, but I remember it's Crosshair now. Alright, so we're good with that. Um, what you got to say? No, I don't have one. A lot. Can I battle this guy? Hold on, let me save. Kind of, I don't know, I look kind of suspicious, you know. I'm just gonna make sure. Oh no, we can actually battle him. Okay. Alright, so we can get his Gear Griff. Isn't that what you wanted for the trade, too? I don't think this flame impact should kill. Oh no, okay, definitely not kill. I thought it was like steel. I guess I'll catch this thing since it is like a static Pokemon. Alright, so you guys ever want to catch Gar Gargriff? I guess Gargoyle and um, what is it? Um, Griffin. Yeah. Alright, we have an Ultras. Yeah. Then um, there you go. Oh my God! Come on, bro. Let's not make this more difficult than it needs to be. Heal through rebuild. That's a cool ability. Um. Oh, torment. Okay. Let's set up some some strats. Is, re is rebuild just when um rock moves are used? I just make this like a small separate video to show everybody how to get gear griff. Alright, yeah, there we go. Alright, so you guys do want to get gear griff. It is in Venice City. I don't know if it's, um, if you have to wait for a specific time. You have to wait for night or not? Maybe you do. But it's in this like little park right here beside the Pokemon Center. I don't know if it spawns back every day or not. I'll have to look at that. But anyway, if you do want one, you can go there and I think she actually trades for it. Oh no, she trades you. What? If I can catch a... If I, okay, never mind. Let's not even go there. Alright, did we heal up before we went off in that little tangent? I went for the Pokeball. Okay. Yo, no we didn't. Okay. I want to check out this Gear Griff anyway. Yeah, I might just make a guide for all the static Pokemon. Just make like a small, you know, showing how it is. All right, so let's check this thing out. So we got Gargriff. Calm nature, rebuild, stored HP will not damage on turn. Okay, that's pretty cool ability. So we got Rock Throw, Torment, Stealth, Rack, Ancient Power. Stat wise, I can see it's pretty defensive. Decent stats overall, I guess, but um, definitely focuses on defense. Seems more like a support Pokemon, kinda. Cause you get the Stealth Rocks and the Torment to try to give you like some rebuild damage. I mean, rebuild recovery. All right, but um, yeah, that is how you catch a uh, Gargriff. So hope you guys enjoyed that little thing. But uh, I'm gonna continue on with this episode. Alright, so we need to head to 
south of here. And we have to teach Pokemon Dive, okay. Sidene's gonna become my HM slave, I don't want that to happen. Alright, where's the move the leader at? Does it say? Alright, I guess we don't, we don't we won't worry about that now. Cause we have to teach it to him anyway. Um, nope. Well, my boy, um, the Tinker dude, he ain't been coming through. Alright, side aim. I guess you get a physical water move. Well, yeah, we can just switch it out with um, Aqua Tail, even though it's stronger, right? But it has better accuracy, so I guess we'll. I guess it's a decent swap out. Alright, repels on. There we go. Alright, so apparently we head south. Not that way. Do I know where I'm going? This way? Alright, this seems right. Nope, definitely not right. Alright, this way. Here we go. Hmm. Definitely don't want our fire ground Pokemon in front. That's a no-no. Uh, Luxlong. I think Luxlong is just the best. Like I said, I wanted to try to side D. Side D. But uh, we'll go with Luxlong for now. So we got former Roland coming through. He has a Blubberog. This is actually a bad matchup for us. Yeah, and the funny thing is, our Achilles would have been decent to deal with that. Alright, um. Grash Knight. I guess he. Okay, he's a little bit lower level. Just don't poison me, that would be annoying. Oh my gosh. I said blubber rock, it's bluebell rock. I cannot read. Alright, there we go. Dude, how did that not kill? You gotta be kidding me. Get a boost right here. We're gonna be the competitive set for um, astronaut. I would like to be the one to claim it. The charge beam set. All right, what's it? What else you got? Brain your. Ooh, villain car. There you go. It's a little, it's a little working. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Dude, this thing is great. Great move set now. Alright, I can tell. That's gonna do some damage. Yeah, we got some glass cannon on this team. But Lux Long, you know, he 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 got the bulk. Alright, there we go. Bloodlust gets us some more HP. Alright. Let's see what the miss is. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Um. Nope, I'm dumb. What am I looking for? Medicine for you. Here we go. I'm gonna pause it real quick and just check on the time real quick. Yeah, we're doing alright on time. We can keep going. 
It's only about 20 minutes. I want to make it at least 30. I want to go. I want it between 30 and 40. I think for this episode. Shrimp beauty. Do I like the design? Alright, so definitely water. But it wasn't super effective, was it? So I'm not sure. Glavinug. Maybe water still? Uh, I think we're staying against Glavinug. Since they're so, like, under leveled. Because it's, it's because we could have reached this um, before we went to the 7th gym. That's why their levels like this. So I guess we could have grinded up here. But we're here now, so. That didn't kill. Wow, I'm about to die to level 38 Pokemon. Alright, we're still living though. That thing's actually bulkier than it looks, I guess. I would think this thing would be like fast and high special attack. That's usually how I judge the just the stats of the new Pokemon. Just look at them. All right, Titanis, Wiggle, Achilles, or Side. This thing still have on um, the Iron Tail. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to. Uh, yeah, we're going to Side. Yeah. Don't miss. There we go. Alright, that's gonna kill him. Definitely. I think Titanite has Mega Evolution. Don't quote me on that though. Alright, so we got a place we can dive. Oh, she wants them digits. Of course. Let's so dive here. See what we can find. Oh, do we have like some. Dive dudes. Okay, so team 30. Oh, wow, 30. 55, Brian. Oh, what it does is, um, does twice the damage. Pokemon's HP is half. Something like that. Close to half. Hey, you're interrupting my solo dive. Alright, Diver Perch. Avid. There's Fire Water. Okay. Now we're back at the <laughs> now we're back at the expected levels. Okay. What? Is this fire? Oh, I'm cold now. Okay, I might just have to stay in to be honest, and then send a nucleon afterwards. This fire water is to do neutral, but it's yes, yeah, fire water. La vint. So it's like a lamprey. Or more that's a lamprey that thing I think it is or more ill sort of coming out of like a thermal vent what is it um, geothermal vent look at me with the big big words <sighs> all right that's the college knowledge all right so we just destroyed that thing probably would have died to the dragon rush I will use Dragon Rush. Oh, uh, we'll revive up. Alright, so we can resurface here. Got a different one user pal. Let's see what it was down here. Is that right there? Alright, it's the sound the coral makes when it shatters. Some of some coral is definitely down underwater. Alright, so he's a brainy or a brain or Can I just switch? I'm gonna be a man and just went directly into the car, predicting the psychic type move. Just gonna be a man right here.
Yep. Look at <laughs> give me a certain dominance on NPCs on the AI. Alright. Should be a two A KO though. Yeah. Eh? Yeah? I don't know. Without the crit. Uh, it still probably would have been. Alright, no crit, no boost. That's all I ask. That's a lot of damage though. Alright, so I'm getting some HP back. I'm guessing this other Pokemon is Corsif or whatever it is. Alright, 44. We getting back into it. Two bar uh, water dark. Uh, yeah. Counter. Wow. Ah, uh, yeah. It does have like ice type moves, I guess. So yeah, it's not exactly a counter, but it's the closest thing we have. I used to call this thing Tubber Reel, but I guess it's more Tubar. Tubar. As in, like, protrusions. And look at me with. I'm dropping too much knowledge right now. Let me chill out. Let's do some damage. Can we get a 2 KO? Can we get a little max right here? Nope. I know we're kind of pushing it right there. But I'm actually faster than this thing. I might just. I might moonlight on the. Yeah, what do I lose by moonlighting here? Worst case scenario though, for he he hit it breaks through. Yeah, that's not even bad, cause I get more HP. As long as he doesn't crit, I will come out winning in this situ situation at all times. Of course, it's gonna snap out though, so. Let's try this again. Like, what do I lose from? I don't lose anything from moonlighting here. You gotta hit yourself, though, buddy. There you go. Look at that. We fighting on the water here. Still, still nothing. Yeah, he does have a course Eve. Or course of reef. Why is it course Eve? This is four times effective, but we'll see how much it does. Okay, it's okay. Never mind. I'm just underestimating this thing because it was Luxor for so long. It is. You can find rare items and shards by breaking up old dead coral. Plus, it helps revitalize the ecosystem. I give you this TM. Coral break. Like. Rock smash almost. Let's see if we can learn it. So it's completely different. I mean, new move. Physical damage. Of course, side is the only one that can learn it. I just want to see the base power, so I'm not going to teach to him now. Attack does physical damage, but it's okay. But it's taking your special, so I guess it's like a secret sword, sacred sword, one of them, whichever one it was. <laughs> All right, bro, you can't be calling me underwater, man. How did I just answer this man underwater? I'm like, <laughs> all right, all right, so we're kind of chilling under here. Right, let's see what we got right here. Got an item. Rain dance. All right, I think I might battle this dude in, in the episode. It will continue off from this point. I guess we have to. Uh, I see a place to resurface. If this is the end of like the underwater, I might have to resurface. Crowvolver. Alright, um. Flash getting so it is still. And so I did just mess up. 
It's probably gonna kill. Yeah. And he has a crit. Okay. And his ability is probably like sniper. So we have still water. Uh, we don't have too much to match up against that, to be honest. We go into Achilles. Try to hit him hard with the with the mega magnitude, I guess. Look at the mega of underwater. Okay, this should do a decent amount. This thing looks like it's gonna have like bad defenses, so alright, that does enough I guess. We're definitely gonna doubt at this though. No question. Okay, Astronaut. Maybe Villacarkin? Not really. Um definitely go for Brick Break. This should two AK off net. No it won't. Well, Of course he hits, dude. You need to calm down, big dog. Alright, uh, Nucleon is still just destroyed our team, too. So we are a little bit under level. I might have to grind a little bit. I should have been sent this in, to be honest. I thought it was still with it, like, made it neutral. Siren Tide, you know, stand. Hydro pump. How does it faster? Come on, man. Live. There we go. This will kill. Uh, maybe not, but I do have a quick attack, so I'm not even tripping. I should probably go for hyper voice. Boofer. Hit, but I want those flinches. Alright. This is gonna be the end of the world. Round six, no, uh, not. All right, I'm gonna end the episode here, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys in the next one.